Coach PJ here. Have you ever left a conversation and wish you'd handled it differently? Or perhaps 10 minutes after the conversation ended, you knew the perfect thing to say. Recently, I had several clients that had a similar challenge. Whether it be an employee, a customer, a competitor, or just another person, somewhere along the line, you've had a conversation that didn't necessarily go as planned and it took you a little bit off your A game at the moment. One client had a challenge with a competitor, another a team member, and even another one with a client, and they all brought it to my attention. Fortunately, they called me prior to or shortly after the challenge surfaced, and they started by saying, hey coach, how should I handle this? And after learning about the situation and coaching them through their specific circumstances, I told them the same thing I tell everybody of which I'll share today. Be calm, be clear, be firm, be consistent. When you get into a conversation with somebody that becomes emotional, it escalates quickly, or you can feel the energy or tone shift, things can move very quickly and rationality is set aside. Your best option when this happens is to first recognize it. Then do your very best to be calm, be firm, be clear, and be consistent. No one is gonna win that conversation. First, be calm. Validate how the person is feeling. This does not mean that you have to agree with them or support their position. Rather, you are validating how they feel about the situation. Provide them feedback that the individual has been heard. I have one client who will do a morning meditation when he knows he has a difficult conversation with a team member. He runs through the conversation in advance, imagines how calm he's going to be, how articulate he's going to be, and how he's going to deliver the message so that it can be heard by the individual. He actively works on picturing a positive outcome. The second item, be clear. Be clear and be brief in your messaging. Do not react, take a step back, ask questions if necessary to be more clear in your understanding. Then be firm. Be firm with, in what you expect. You run the show. You are calling the shots. Whether it's a vendor, a customer, or a team member, you decide how you plan to handle the situation. Spend your time on the solution. People like spending 80, 90% of the time on the challenge and only 10, 20% on the solution, or if at all. They just want to vent. And finally, be consistent on how you show up in these conversations. When a conversation is escalating and you're calm and clear and you're willing to listen and you're willing to be firm with your solutions and you're able to do this each and every time, you will see success. When you are firm with your authority, you are authentic, you are clear, you are consistent, you will see it as a huge impact on yourself and the entire team around you, including your customers. If this is something that you're interested in learning more about, I have a number of ways to do that. We can jump on a quick call, we can get together for coffee, or if you know that this is absolutely what you need and you wanna get started right away, I offer a complimentary coaching session where we'll dig deep into your business, identify the opportunities, and put a plan in place to go forward. If you got value from this video, like, subscribe, comment below, leading real people to achieve real results. Your business profit. Until next time.